Hi, and welcome to our Facebook page setup tutorial. In the following tutorial, I'll show you how you can create a Facebook page that you can add your eBay social store to. First of all, I want to make it clear that a Facebook page isn't a Facebook personal profile that you can use to connect with your friends on Facebook. A Facebook profile is a private page that is for personal use, while a Facebook page is for business use and adds a marketing value to it. Also, your Facebook profile can only be seen by your friends on Facebook, while a fan or business page is completely public. So while only up to 5,000 Facebook users can see your profile, everyone can see your page, which is definitely great for your sales. And the best part is that you can add apps to your Facebook page, such as our social store app. Okay, so now that we clarified what's a Facebook page, let's get it set up in a few simple steps. Let's start out by going to Facebook's homepage. Now to create a new page, let's go to facebook.com slash pages slash create. Next, we'll need to log into our Facebook account. If you don't have a Facebook account, click on sign up for Facebook to create one. To create our page, we'll first need to choose a main category. The best category for your page as an eBay seller is the brand or product category. Now in the drop down menu, let's choose a subcategory for our page. So if for instance you sell jewelry, let's choose the watches and jewelry category. And let's choose a name for our page. If you're not sure about the name of your page, don't worry, you can always change it later. Now after reading Facebook's page terms, click on get started. Now in the next window, we'll be asked to fill out some information for our page. First, let's fill out the description. This is a short description that we'll show at the top of our page. We'll also be able to add a longer description later. This description will help search engines index your page in search results. Here you can add a link to a website. So fill in the link to your eBay store or the link to your eBay profile page. Next, you'll be asked to choose a unique web address for your page. So the best option here is to enter your store URL. If you don't have an eBay store, just enter the name you gave your page. Next, select yes for is your page name a real business product or brand? And now if this is the official Facebook page for eBay store, choose also yes for will your page name be the authorized and official representation of this business product or brand on Facebook. By this, you're stating that you have the authority to open a Facebook page for your store. Let's click on save info and let's continue to the next window. In the next window, we'll be able to add a profile picture or a logo to our page. The size of this image should be 180 on 180 pixels. So just choose the image on your computer and click on next to continue. In the next window, we'll be able to add our page to our favorites, which means you'll always see your page in your favorites area on the left of your Facebook timeline. So just click on add to favorites or click on skip to continue. Now in the next window, you can choose if you would like to advertise your page. I recommend that you wait until your page is up and running and then just uh, consider advertising your page. That's it. You'll now be sent to your new page and you'll be able to add your social store to it. For more information, visit our site at www.socialstorepro.com.